guys, it's me, Mary Bonds, and I am back with another video. You a former actor, Today is Friday, April 28th, and it's currently 6.50 p.m., and I have baby Sturgeon here. And I thought it would be fun to show you guys all the babies, not all the babies that I have, but all the babies that I have here. So I do still have um, quite a bit of other babies. I have three other babies for sale that are not going to be in this video. And then five personal babies that are also not going to be in this video as well. These are just the video. These are, these are just the babies that I have here currently with me right now. Um, so anyways, first I'm going to be showing you guys the babies that I got like in order. I'm going to be telling you guys their scope or kit name as well as the name that I gave them and things like that. We have baby seven. I named him seven. And this is the Nathan scoped by Helen Connors, poured and molded by Tracy Harrington. And I got his blank scoped last year in February. And then he was brought to life at the either the end of April, no, early May. And he is currently for sale. He's a full body silicone. Um, the quality for this video is going to be bad. I'm just going to let you guys know that right now. I'm using um, a phone. I'm using the front facing camera. You guys know the front facing camera is worse than the back. So this is him. He is currently available for sale. And yeah. So this is the first baby that I got last year. And I named him Seven, but he is the Nathan sculpt by Helen Connors. And he's poured in a solid platinum silicone by Tracy Harrington. And again, he is for sale. Okay, next we have Mr. Saint. So this is Saint. And he is the April sculpt by Joanna K. Sorry guys, the quality is so bad. I'm trying to make it a little bit better. But he's the April kit by Joanna Casmer Zach. And I got him last year, February as well. I got seven first as a blank sculpt, and then I got him. So yeah, I got him last year. He is not for sale. The only ones that I tell you guys for sale are the ones for sale, but everyone else is just in my personal collection. But yeah, this is him. He needs an outfit change. He's been wearing this for quite a while, but he is a super snuggly baby. And he has, I think, a wafer in his body, maybe. And he's been smelling so good ever since he came to me. So this is Saint. And again, he is the April sculpt by Joanna K. And again, I got him last year, February. But uh, let me say this for both Seven and Saint. Um, so I got them in february but i got seven's blank scoped in february and i shipped out his blank scoped in april to his artist to paint and he was finished and shipped to me in may however i didn't open him until august um for seven his amazing mommy let me actually i asked her i was like hey do you think it's okay if you just hold on to him until i tell you to ship him she was like yeah sure and so he came to me in August as well. End of August, early September. No, he came to me in August. Yeah, so I got him in February, but um, he came to me in August because I asked her if she can keep him until I was ready to get him. And she was like, yeah. So next we have this little boy. And he was not supposed to be planned. The only two babies that were supposed to have been planned was seven and April for last year and they were barely supposed to be planned but I always got to get a baby every year and it seems to be I always get more than one so this is Sunny by Joanna K and I got him last year June so this is him and a little funny story about him actually is in May, I actually ended up buying two other babies who are no longer here with me. But in May, I bought two babies. And then 
a couple of days, if not a couple, like one or two days after he was available. I saw he was available for sale. And he has been a dream baby of mine since 2017. This exact baby, this exact baby, not just this scope, but this exact baby has been a dream baby of mine since 2017. And when I saw him for sale, I almost cried because I was like, I just bought two babies. And I really, I can't buy any more babies. But I ended up buying him. And I usually, I don't usually do any, um, I usually don't do layaway or payment plans, but for him, I was like, maybe that might be best for him. That way I don't get too many babies back to back. And then I was like, that way, you know, it's not really hurting my pockets as much. So, I, <laughs> um, yeah, I was like, let me just reach out. And I was like, I just bought, a, I was like, I just bought two babies literally like yesterday or whatever. And they were like, should he be number three? So I ended up getting him anyways. And yeah, so he came to me in June and again, I opened him up in August, if you guys know why. So yeah, this is Baby Milano. I didn't even tell you guys his name, but most of you guys know who he is if you watch my channel. But yeah, this is Milano and he is the Sunny Sculpt by Joanna Kastner Zach. Okay, next we have Baby September. So she was unplanned as well i was really after milano i was really supposed to have been done with babies but how how could i resist her how could i resist her <laughs> so i saw that she was up for sale in august and i ended up getting her after stalking her for about a day or two three days max maybe oops i know it was in a span of three days and i ended up getting her and she was a birthday baby so yeah, she is the Merle Sculpt by Lillian Breville, and she is poured by Claire Taylor, and she's a full body silicone. So this is her, and I named her September since she was a birthday baby. I wanted her to come in September, but she came very quickly in August, <laughs> and I didn't want to say, oh, you know what, you could just wait to ship her out to me because I was so, so excited to get her and I'm still am excited that I got her. She has a lot of like, she came to me with a lot of glitter on her and she still does have a lot of glitter on her. I gave her a bath, but that doesn't help much. So um, yeah, but this is September. Again, she is the Moral Sculpt by Lillian Breville. And yeah, that's her. That's my little September. And I got her in August. <laughs> Okay, next we have Zolena, aka Zoe. She's having a bad, crazy hair day, so don't judge her. <laughs> her hair is like so wild and it's everywhere, it's like all over the place. But we have Zolena, um, and her nickname is Zoe, and she is the Susu Sculpt by Natalie Blake. She's such a big baby, I love her size. And look at her outfit, so cute. And I got her in January of this year and I was really supposed to have got her in November but um as of lately I've been doing payment plans that way I don't have too many dolls in my collection so I've just been doing payment plans and I've just been doing little way that way I don't have too many dolls I'm bringing in at once so I ended up doing the little way for her and so started it in november and i got her in january i was like okay it's time to bring her home no more playing games <laughs> so yeah this is zoe who is the susu kit by natalie blick and this is her oh also guys i forgot to tell you i got the blank zoe kit by natalie blick I got that kit in September and that kit, I am also selling the blank kit. So if anyone's interested, let me know, but I didn't bring the kit here because it's in a box and there's so many boxes. I didn't feel like grabbing it. I already had to grab all these babies and bring them in the room. So I didn't feel like grabbing the kit because again, it's in boxes and it's so far away. Well, it's not far away. It's just packed away. So um, I do have the Zoe 
kit by Natalie Blick. It is blank and I do have it for sale and I got that kit in September by the way. But again, if you guys are interested then let me know. But anyways, this is Zoe. She's not the Zoe kit, but that's just her name. She's the Susu and she's so cute. And again, don't mind her here. But this was her Easter outfit. Yeah, this was her Easter outfit. But this is Zoe. I can't believe she's been with me since January. It's been that long. It doesn't feel like it. Yeah, this is her. She says hi. <laughs> okay, we're coming down to our last two babies. And this baby you guys have not saw. And there is a reason why you guys haven't saw this baby which I may or may not share, but there's a few of you that know why I haven't shared this baby. And there's also a few of you that um, saw this baby. And those people are the ones who are subscribed to my emails. So they had a chance to see this baby a long time ago. And they also got the chance to like know why. And they even got like an exclusive video or whatnot. So if you want to subscribe to my emails, you guys can go ahead. It's linked in the description and it is 100% free. All I do is just share really whatever comes to my mind about the babies and the dolls and things like that. Anyways, this baby I got in March. I got the second week of March, like March 7th, March 11th, first, second week. And... Again, you guys have not saw this baby, so I am going to show you guys this baby. Such a big baby. And look at the shoes. And these are some really cute shoes. And he doesn't really fit them, but they're still cute. And they're, like, not too, too big where it looks funny. But anyways, let me show you guys this baby. This is Margot by Cassie Brace. And he is super cute. I made him a boy, but I'm sure he'll look cute as a girl because as you guys can see, he has a head full of curly blonde hair. And he did have a ponytail in his hair, but I stole it and I gave it to the next baby I'm going to show. But he had a ponytail because his hair can fit in the ponytail really, really nice. Um, I'll have to buy some more ponytail holders and um, hair accessories for the babies. But this is the back of his hair. But yeah, anyways, I got this baby in March. Excuse me, guys. I got this baby in March. And this baby is for sale. So if you guys are interested, then you guys can let me know. He does look a little funny right here. All of the babies probably look horrible. This was probably the worst angle lighting <laughs> and way I could do this video to showcase them. But I can always send additional photos and videos. But yeah, this is Margot. I love this kit. Such a very big, chunky baby. And again, I am selling this baby. But yeah, I got him in March of this year. So about a month ago. And again, he's for sale. He has uh, gray eyes, by the way. Gray glass eyes. Yeah, that's him. And again, he is available for adoption if any of you are interested. So um, the first baby I showed you guys, who is the full body silicone boy, seven, he's for sale. This baby right here is for sale. I have the blank Zoe kit by Natalie Blick for sale. And then I also have three other babies that are packed away, literally ready to ship. Like they're in a box with tape over it, everything. The babies that are already packed up that I didn't show in this video are all budget babies. They're all under $200 or less. And again, they're ready to go. So if you're interested in this baby, seven, the blanket, or the three other budget babies I have available, you guys can email me. My email is myareborns.yt at gmail.com. Or if you don't want to email me, you can DM me on Instagram, myareborns. Maya underscore reborns on Instagram. So yeah. And last but not least, we have my newest girl, my big girl, Bubbles. Well, Bubbles is her nickname. Her real name is Solana, and she is the Mimi Kit by Ping Wow, and she is 32 inches. She's a long baby. She's a long baby. <laughs> and I got her in April. 
Yeah, I just got her. I got her in April. I inquired about her in January, but again, I have too many babies. I was hoping a baby would sell, but I, that way I can bring in another baby into my collection. But it didn't, so I inquired about her in January, and I was like, I was like, Lilway would be the best option. Just hoping that a baby would sell so I can have more room and more space to bring home this baby. No baby sold, and I was like, I want my big girl home. So I was like, let me pay her off. <laughs> I got her in uh, April. So yeah, this is Solana, aka Bubbles. And again, she is the Mili kit by Ping Wow, and I gave her this really cute ponytail. It's kind of little, but she said don't talk about her. <laughs> and I did her edges. Did her edges like I would, how I would have done mine. But this is how the back of her hair looks in case anyone was wondering i did her hair i didn't realize it was crooked right here or does it only look crooked on camera and it's supposed to be like a straight little look in there because i leave hair out in the back of my hair too like this and i do like high ponytails and things like that so i decided to do it on her but anyways i did her hair a couple of days ago and i just shared the photo with you all today on my community tab but yeah so this is her and this is her hair but she is my last baby possibly my last baby for 2023 i don't know we'll see if i can get some babies going then there for sure will be one or two other babies coming in but if I can't get any babies sold, then she might just be my last baby of 2023. Again, this this quality isn't the best, so I do apologize. But you guys know how beautiful she is as well as my other babies are. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I don't know why I just randomly wanted to do this video. I always get asked to do a collection video. And I have yet to make one because like, I got asked to make one like 2020. I was like, yes, I'll do one. And then I was waiting for, I was waiting for one of my babies to come and they ended up not coming until like after I moved because I thought that would be the smart thing to do. But then I had three of my forever babies in storage. So I was like, there's no point in me making a collection video and they're still in storage. So I was like, there's no point in me making a collection video. So I think this is the closest thing to a collection video until I get all my babies with me and the ones that I'm not selling as well. So I thought, this would be a fun video showing you guys just all the babies I have here with me for sale or not for sale. So yeah, this is my little fun video. I hope you guys all enjoyed it again. I'm sorry for the bad quality. Like, it's showing up horrible quality that I'm looking at right now. So it's probably going to show up bad quality when I post the video. Just make sure you have the highest setting on for quality while you're playing it on YouTube. Anyways, that's it for this video. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, you guys go ahead and do so. My Instagram is my underscore reborns. Again, if anyone is interested in the two babies that I just showed and the other three babies I have for sale as well as one that is a blank kit, then you guys can let me know by emailing me or messaging me on Instagram. I don't do business in the comments. Anyways, yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys liked it, Give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you guys want in the comments, including video requests. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Also, ring that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post a new video. And we will talk to you guys later. Bye.